Hello and welcome to Lightworks. In this tutorial we're going to have a look at dragging clips from the bin into the edit viewer. Let's get started. Pick up the first shot, drag and drop it into the edit viewer. When you drag and drop to the edit viewer the edit mode is insert. The clips inserted to the timeline and the play position indicator, this red line here, is moved to the end of the clip automatically. Shot 2, shot 3, shot 4. If we move the timeline position indicator, anywhere else on the timeline, any subsequent shots that are dropped into the viewer will be laid down from this point onwards. The insert edit mode is a non-destructive edit, much like working with pieces of film. I'd like to insert the next clip at this edit point here. I'm going to use my jump backwards button to accurately step back through my sequence. Now, when we drop the next clip in, it'll splice itself in at that point. Jump forward to this cut point, using the step forward to the next cut. We'll drop the last shot in there. To change the edit mode, to replace when you're dragging and dropping between the bin and the edit viewer you need to use the shift modifier you need to press the shift key after you pick up a clip from the bin and before you drop it into the edit viewer let's have a look at that stepping back a few cuts let's overwrite at this point here forwards pick up the clip then press shift drag drop and release the edit time remains the same and the clip's been overwritten. One more time. Pick up the clip, press shift, drag and release. Using either insert or replace drag and drop modes, you're free to pick up multiple clips from your bin. Let's insert four clips at the current time here. To select multiple clips in the bin, first hold down the control key and select each clip you require. The order will be left to right and then top to bottom just like storyboarding. If you're in this view the order of the clips will be top to bottom. Click, drag and drop to the edit viewer. The shots are inserted and the sequence length extends. To perform an overwrite as we've already learnt click, press shift, drag and drop. Four shots are overwritten and the sequence length remains the same. Moving back to the top of the timeline, I'd like to put some audio in this area here. Let's go to the audio bin. First of all, I need to deselect the tracks I don't want to be affected by the edit. So we're going to use the shift modifier to modify it to replace drag and drop. Pick up the clip, press shift, drag and drop with A3 and A4 selected. We hope that's helpful. Thanks for watching. 